With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, let us see the question. The question given is match the following two columns and choose the correct answer. So for better understanding, let us first arrange the two columns. On column A, on the side, let us write it here. So on one side, I am writing column A and on the other side, there is column B. So in column A, if we see the options, the, at first we have serine, then we have cysteine and then we have tyrosine and lastly we have glutamic acid which is also known as glutamate so these are the names of the essential and the non-essential amino acids so on column a we have the names of amino acids and on column b we have several letters so at first we have y then we have c then we have s and we have e so these uh, essential and non-essential amino acids, they are denoted by several single letters. So these single letters, they act as abbreviations for better or for easier, so that they are easier to write and easier to understand. So thus each, every, each and every essential and non-essential amino acid, they have a code which is a single letter. So the code for serine, if we see, Serine is denoted by the letter S. Cysteine, it is denoted by letter C. Tyrosine, it is denoted by letter Y. And glutamate or glutamic acid, it is denoted by letter E. So if we see our options here, then A is here matched with 3. B is matched with 2. So A, B, c and d you right and this is one three and four according to the question so a it is matched with three c it is b it is matched with two and c it is matched with one and d with four so the right option is the third option here so this is the right option for this question I hope this solves your doubt. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.